In today's video, I've got five facts about 25th Bam from the series Tower of God slash a character analysis video. We will be going over Bam's bio, his voice actors, abilities in the anime, and more. And a quick warning that there will be spoilers, so just a heads up. And this video will only cover up to part one of the webtoon because that's where I believe the anime will cover. And for more weekly anime character fact videos, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss a video. Anyway, with that being said, let's roll intro and get straight into the video. Twenty-fifth Bam, or Bam for short, is the main protagonist of the series, who made his debut in episode 1 of the anime and chapter 1 of the webtoon. Bam is an irregular and has entered the tower in search of his best friend Rachel, who of course is another irregular. He is a young human male that stands at 5 foot 5 1, which is roughly 168 centimeters. Bam has short dark brown hair and golden amber eyes. Now, if there is one thing we have learned about Bam in terms of appearance, is that he is quite a catch with the girls. He has been called cute multiple times and has even been called a hottie. Noise. Attire-wise, Bam goes through a few in part one. First of all, when he first comes to the tower, he is wearing a long-sleeved brown shirt with the sleeves partially turned up, with a red vest and beige trousers, as well as a pair of grey boots and scarf. After the events of the crown game test, Bam receives a regular uniform of its lower tier, that is a long black trench coat with gold linings, black trousers, and a black headband. His final attire change is during the hide and seek test. This is like combat clothes and follow the same black theme as his last attire. Personality wise, Bam is someone that looks gentle on the surface but has an underlining courage when fighting for the right cause, as we saw in that first episode. Bam seems to have little to no knowledge on life in general as he can't remember anything of his past before meeting Rachel, who had taught him everything he knew. She was pretty much all he had as he has had no contact with anyone prior to meeting her. The courage I spoke of earlier is pretty much how naive Bam is, just as he has had little to to no understanding on life, the same is applied to his knowledge of the tower, and his sole reason for climbing it was just to be with Rachel again. Now, there is one thing that Bam hates, and I guess this adds to his drive when it comes to climbing the tower, and that thing is loneliness. Not just his own loneliness, but the same loneliness felt by others. Though Bam has this naive side to him, and like mentioned, has little knowledge on most things, he is a very caring and empathetic person. Bam's Japanese voice actor is Taichi Ichikawa. He has voiced other characters such as Kurosu Kurago in Kabuki Boo, Maki Seiji from Bloom Into You, Agawa in The Disastrous Life of Psyche K2, Kengo from Hinamatsuri, and more. I imagine that Tower of God is probably getting an English dub, but I haven't seen who they have cast, so no info here on that just yet. In terms of abilities, Bam pretty much has nothing at the start of the series, albeit for sheer courage and determination. Fighting skills were a complete no-go to begin with, his stance was all over the place, and hesitation was very clear to see in his movements. He did or does have a very dangerous ability though, and that was that he is a very quick learner. This would start to develop as Bam would be the one to always find the best solution or strategy. His quick learning starts to reach its potential during the hide-and-seek test Test, where he instantly copied a technique called fast skip just a few seconds after his body came into contact with it. Now, to put this into context, this technique usually takes around a decade to learn, so pretty awesome. His skills begin to develop later in the series as he undergoes training and is shown to be able to manipulate the Shinsu, something most regulars struggle with. He was described as having a born talent for it, as well as being complimented as the most talented regular, going as far as being considered as a Royal Enforcement Division candidate. 
crazy. Towards the end of the series, Bam has learnt close combat and has become very good at dodging punches, which I guess is handy. Black March is a B-rank needle and ignition weapon that Yuri had lent to Bam in the very first episode. This is a part of the 13-month series, made by a blacksmith named Ashil Edwaru. Black March is a jet black needle that is thicker at its handle, and on said handle, Black March is written upon it in cursive. In the anime, Black March had a change in appearance as it took on the form of a blade rather than a needle. This is said to be so that it resembled a Chokito, which is a straight bladed weapon brought into Japan from Korea. Black March is, like I said, an ignition weapon that has the spirit of a girl inside of it. Once the weapon is ignited, it takes on the form of this beautiful young lady with long golden hair and pointy ears like that of an elf. This spirit does not listen to anyone and will not ignite for just anybody. And it does appear that this spirit is a little bit sexist, as she will ignite for a handsome male, and when asked for power by Bam, the spirit declared that he was just her type. Well, his cute face anyway. So she lent him her power. But thanks for watching this, my video. Five facts about 25th Bam from the series Tower of God. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you'd like to see more characters from this series, let me know in the comments. A quick shout out to Warwick and Animator22 for supporting me on Patreon, as well as the beautiful bunch displayed on the screen, and of course, the rest of you supporting me on the other tiers. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for supporting me. If you're interested in what rewards I have to offer on my Patreon, the link is below. Don't forget to smash the like button if you enjoyed this video. Check out those other links in the video description and subscribe for more anime content. Till next time, my fellow weebs. Peace.